All right, thank you, Jason. Well, today is September 11th, and we are remembering and reflecting on 22 years since the terrorist attacks, the deadliest in American history. This is a live look at the skyline of Manhattan in New York City. Across the country, remembrance ceremonies are happening to honor the thousands of lives lost that day and to thank our first responders. Denver 7's Wanye Reese joins us live from Red Rocks Amphitheater this morning, where a stair climb will be starting in a couple of hours. Uh, good morning, Wanye. How is it out there this morning? Good morning to you, Brian and Nicole. It's really quiet out here right now. There's just some workers who are working on making sure that they're putting the finishing touches on everything so that the event goes off very well this morning. And this morning around 846 is when we're expecting everything to be starting up out here, the stair climb at the Red Rocks Amphitheater to honor those many lives that were lost on 9-11 and also to honor those first responders who came out to the scene to make sure that everybody um, was safe and that everybody was taken care of. Now, I actually got the chance to speak with a Colorado man who went out there to New York City to help out after those September 11 attacks. Now, I spoke with Mr. Steve Azeltine, who is a first responder from Colorado, who works with the Colorado Task Force One. Azeltine told me that the task force that is supported by FEMA is uh, there to respond to different emergency disasters in our country. So when 9-11 happened, he says it took days to arrive to New York City. And when his team got there, it was his job to take care of people on the task force and anybody else who may have been impacted by those attacks as well. As we remember this 22nd anniversary, he tells me that he remembers the camaraderie of New York City, even in the time of uncertainty. I think what really stood out to me again is, is how all the, 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 the people in the, in the community of New York came together to, to help all of the responders that were, were working in that area, whether that's with, with feeding or, 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 or trying to just make sure that you had facilities, transportation back and forth to where, you know, you're, you're sleeping, but everybody was, was working extremely hard to just try and help every, everybody else out. Again, live out here at Red Rocks, we are expecting everything to be starting up at around uh, 7. That's when registration is going to start. And then around 846, that is when the ceremony is going to uh, officially be, uh, you know, beginning. And, you know, Ryan and Nicole, he just hit on so many great topics when I had my conversation with him. And it always amazes me, no matter what side of the country that you're on, in times of tragedy, it's truly when we can all come together. And it's always a beautiful thing to see. All right, we, we expect a lot of people, hundreds out there today. Thank you, Wanye. Mm -hmm.